Okay, so it's how tax money could be spent there. When Chris Martin married Gwyneth, that's some serious VAT, we could have paid Messi to play in Plymouth. From the tender age of three, I found a vocal coach for Cheryl. But as everybody knows, dislike her at your pedal, because what Simon says goes. We could pay for Boris Johnson to have a simple back and sides. We could ban Mark fucking Ronson from every venue nationwide. We could guarantee that car insurance is easily acquired. And then that bloody go compared advert is no longer required. We could make sure every hospital has plenty of beds to lie in. Every mother has the food to stop a baby crying. Every school is modernised with flourishing resources. And higher education is possible for kids who don't have horses. Pension plans are plenty, and savings are actually safe. I know I'm only 25 and I'm sounding rather grave, but we're such a moral fuckwits and it can't just be ignored. I'll go back to talking about shagging soon if you're starting to feel bored. Make sure that bloody bus for work is always there on time. And fuck the Olympic Stadium, spend money fighting crime. And funding the royal wedding, Christ I could have cried, how oh, about a one-off special on that show, don't tell the bride. Two and a half million people are said to be unemployed, and everything that Cameron's saying seems to be null and void, because he wants a big society where everyone chips in, and then he spends fucking billions on the wall will never win. Don't tell us we're in it together, just like you're a normal civilian. We're all skint and demoralised and you're worth 33 million. The UK government spending is nothing short of a farce. So you can take yourself assessment form and stick it up your ass. Cheers.